Okay, we have here to another problem on the board from the UNSW integration B2023. This one's from round two, problem nine. We have the integral of dx over x plus x to the fifth. So one interesting thing to note here is this problem is actually really similar to an earlier problem that we had in the same integration. I think it was, I think it was round two, problem two, where they had an e in the exponent here. So we're just gonna do something very similar. And what I'm gonna wanna do is I wanna do a u substitution and I also want to factor something out from this denominator in order to make it happen. Now we could factor an x out, but I think what's going to work better is if I actually factor the x to the fifth out. So if I do that, what's going to happen in our denominator is we're going to have x to the fifth here. This first term is going to become x to the minus fourth. Notice saying multiplying that together is just x. This becomes plus one. And then now at this point, we have something to help us with the u substitution. Because what I can do is I can just write this into the numerator. I can write that as an x to the minus fifth dx in the numerator, and that's gonna set up our u substitution really nicely. So for my u, I'm gonna make my u equal to the denominator, so I'm gonna say u equals x to the minus four plus one. I'll take my derivative, and we'll see that du is gonna be, power rule on this is gonna be minus four x to the minus five, perfect. Derivative of one is zero, and then we just need our dx. Then from here, what I can do is if I multiply here, if I multiply by minus four right here, now I have exactly what we have for our du value. But in order not to change it, we'll just multiply by a minus one fourth. As multiplying these, we're just multiplying by one. Then I'll go ahead and make this substitution right now. So then again, this is our du and this is our u. So we have ourselves a really simple integral. Now integrating this, I'm gonna have minus one fourth, natural log absolute value of u. All I need to do to finish this off is just back substitute. So doing this, let's see, I'm gonna write it as minus natural log, bringing this thing in for u. Now actually, because we have an even power here, this is never gonna be negative. Therefore, I'm gonna drop my absolute value, just write parentheses, and we'll write it as x to the minus fourth plus one. And let's not forget this four right here. Add a plus c on the end, and that's it. So that's it, I'm gonna stop it there. Thanks everyone for watching, have a great day.